Okay, my beautiful Libras. I have tried to do... Mm, sorry. <laughs> I have tried to do two videos on you guys, okay? And what I'm getting, the energy is... Um, It's crazy, the energy that I'm getting. I'm getting energy from very high realms, okay? I'm getting shaman energy, you guys. Like heavy shaman. Even not just shaman energy, I'm getting ET energy, okay? Like the aliens or the other earthly beings out there are trying to communicate with you guys, okay? Um, they might be trying to communicate with you through um, your dream state or even your awake state, okay? This is what, what I'm feeling because when I started this read, I pulled some cards out and um, the angel deck, remember I told you it's called the um, Angels and um, Ancestors. So I was trying to pull the deck out and read which each one of them mean in depth. But spirit was like, no, just read from your soul, okay? Um, but um, I'm feeling like you guys need to follow that voice of your soul because you're getting messages. I'm feeling like somebody I'm speaking to could be a shaman and don't even know they're a shaman. Also, I'm feeling heavy menacing, um, like a menacing woman or a menacing um, man that don't know that they have this gift. Libras, you guys are healers, okay? You're, you're healers, you're natural healers. People gravitate to you, okay? And I feel like that your inner soul, your inner voice is speaking to you right now, okay? And um, you guys are going through so much um, financially, I feel like, and also love. And I feel, too, in some of you guys' foundation, your home environment, okay? You guys are not happy at your job. Some of you guys are not happy um, in your love life. And some of you guys are not happy... Your love, your job, and you're seeing things from a higher perspective, like higher realms. I'm feeling shaman here, a lot of shaman energy and um, the star ancestors, okay? The star ancestors could be the star ancestors. There's different planets, there's different universes. Um, not just the spiritual realm, the star ancestors, okay, are trying to communicate with you, all right? Some of you guys are descendant of the star ancestors, okay? Um, and they're trying to communicate, and this may sound very weird. So if you guys are having like dreams, vivid dreams, and you're awake, and when you are asleep, they're sending you guys messages, okay? Um, and they're saying, follow, follow that voice of your soul and be fearless and stand strong. Um, I feel like you guys been giving too much to others and it's time for you to give to yourself, Libras, because masculine and feminine Libras, you have beautiful souls, Okay. Um, you have beautiful souls because it's like when you're around people, you are who you are and they know that they can feel that. Okay. Because n not just by words, but by actions, they can feel who you are to the core. Okay. And, um, people love to be around you, Libra. And this is why, because of this knowledge that you have. And some of you guys don't even know the knowledge that you have. 
You have knowledge from star ancestors. This is uh, the ancestors in the stars. These are other planet ancestors, okay? They're speaking to you in your aware and woke state, okay? And I'm also seeing the heavenly realms. I've been seeing this for a long time for my Libras. Um, and th this cards, three of these cards keep coming out for you. So this message is for somebody. Um, you guys need to start standing your ground. And what I mean is gracefully, gracefully and patiently. Okay. Um, because you guys have been patiently standing steadfast but i also feel like, feel like you need to be fearless like not in a bad way in a good way okay um because there's something big that's going to happen for my libras okay um you guys are sowing you guys sowed seeds in your life okay and you're getting all this all this love back in return and mentally is messing with you because you can't believe this is happening for you. You're transitioning right in front of your own self. Okay. If you look back at yourself, let's say, let's go back two years. You have came so far from those two years till now. I don't know what you've been through. I know I have. And I know a lot of my other Libras have too, okay? Because you always had this warrior spirit, not just this warrior spirit, you always stood firm and strong. And you sowed those seeds and those seeds are growing. And the seed is you. You have grown I I don't know. I'm saying two, I'm saying two years, but I'm saying years. You have grown. Look where ha look how far you came, Libra. Look how far you came. You've been through a lot. You're still going through a lot. But I feel like things are going to change for you, dr like dr like really fast. Not just really fast. They're gonna change for the better, for Libras. Okay. Because you're shifting. You're shifting your energy. Okay. And you're in communication with the heavenly realms. Not just the heavenly realms. The star ancestors. When you look up in the, the sky. Yeah, there's other, there's other beings out there. And they're trying to communicate with you. And I want you right now to enjoy your success and happiness because this is meant for you, Libra. This, this joy and happiness that's coming into your life is meant for you. You may be... Your perspective right now is going to change. It will change. Okay? It will change. And for the ones that are struggling financially, things will change for you. Because it's saying enjoy success and happiness. You will have the success and happiness that you want it. But you got to understand everything starts internally. When you're happy with yourself, this is where the success happens. When you're standing strong, this is where you come become fearless. When you follow that voice inside, no, when you follow your soul, that's when the voice of your soul
you follow the voice of your soul. You follow who you are on your soul. Okay? Because I try to upload this video three times. And I'm getting messages from star ancestors. These are not heavenly ancestors. These are star ancestors in the sky. When you look up, there's different star ancestors. There's so many of them. And they're trying to communicate with you. In your sleep state, in your awake state. Okay. And they're also saying what the heavenly ancestors are saying is follow, follow the voice of your soul. Trust and thrive. That's the hardest thing is to trust. Trust and thrive. Because once you trust, you will thrive. But you have to trust. Trusting is not easy, Libra. And let go of the need to be right. If you have to leave a situation, leave it gracefully. When I leave any situation, I leave it gracefully. You know why I leave it gracefully? The reason why I leave it gracefully is because I know at the end of the day that it, what is done in the past is the past. So maybe you guys are carrying your past with you and it's time to let it go. And don't be ashamed of your past. Look how far you came. I don't know who I'm speaking to, but look how far you came. You came a long way. The angels are saying you have came a long way. They are actually able to speak to you. Some of, some of you guys, they weren't able to speak to you. I'm talking about your own angels. Your own spirit guides, your own ancestors. But now you can hear them. And why can you hear them now? Is because you are ascending to higher realms of spirituality. And I'm feeling like you guys need to let go of your past or whatever is holding you back. Or whatever is haunting you, let it go. Embrace this new journey that you're about to take and embrace all the things that you're about to receive because they are for you, Libra. They are meant for you, Libra. Okay. They are meant from you. Okay. I tried to upload this video three times and I'm getting messages from the star ancestors. The star ancestors are people that, the beings from the star, people call them UF, UFOs. There's many planets. We're not the only planet here. They're speaking to you. They are coming through. And they are also telling you to follow your voice of your soul. Not just the heavenly realm, the star ancestors. 14, 14 on the clock. I'm talking to somebody that is a shaman. Somebody that, and I feel like you got some of you guys need to meditate more and you need to rest more. You don't see me every day doing videos for Libra. Libras, you guys don't see me doing videos for you guys every day because I, I need rest. Because if I don't have my rest, and I'm not, I'm not going to be good for myself and I'm not going to be good for, for others. And this message is for somebody out there. If you're not resting, you're not going to be good for yourself and you're not going to be good for others. So you need rest. And you need to meditate. 
and you need to get out to get out in nature more. Okay. And this this mental clarity, you will get the answers to this mental clarity. Okay, you will get it. Okay, I'm being told by spirit, you will get it. Okay. Because you're able now to talk. To these angels and your spirit guides and your ancestors and the air guardian she keeps coming out she's saying shift your perspective so your perspective in life needs to be shifted now I'm what I'm getting from spirit is you know how you go every day and you do the same routine, that same routine, that same routine, or you say, I'm going to get this done, or I'm going to make this happen, or I'm going to be in the, I'm going to be here in a year or here in three months, here in, in six months. You're going to be there. So stop worrying. And, and go like that river. You ever see a river, a body of water, and it's just flowing? Flow like that river, Libra. Flow. Flow like that river. It's hard, but you can do it. Flow like that river. I used to worry about everything. This is Libra's. And I'm being told not to worry. Flow like that river. Don't worry, because I'm feeling like somebody's worrying about their finances here, their job situation. Somebody wants to change their job situation. Somebody wants to change their home life, their love relationship. And all three of these, the home, the love, the job, it will happen when it's supposed to happen. Be patient. Be patient, my Libras. Flow like that water in that in that river. Okay, overflow with happiness. Overflow with joy. Stop worrying. Lay those burdens down. Lay them down. And flow like that river. Because... The current of that river, sometimes the current changes, and that's what ha what's happening with you. Your current is going to change. And when it changes, you're going to be right where you're supposed to be. And everything will be all right. But flow like that river. Let that current take you away. Because where that current is going to take you, that current of that river is going to take you, it's going to be so beautiful, Libras. So beautiful. So beautiful. Meditate. When you meditate and you get out in nature, sometimes I feel like some of you guys may be called to get out in nature and you don't go. You should go. There's times where I, spirit is like, get, get out in nature and I don't go, I regret it. And there's times where spirit says, go out in nature and I go. Because that's where I get clarity in my mind with mother nature, okay? Not just with mother nature, I'm in tune with everything. And I feel like a lot of you guys need to find your joy and your happiness and flow like that river. And wherever that river takes you, it takes you. Wherever that river takes you, it's going to be beautiful. Okay, Libra? This is Jennifer Felix, you guys. Libra, stop worrying. Flow like that river. Because where that river will lead you, it's going to be so beautiful. Just imagine that river. 
and you laying in that body river and you just floating with with the water and it just takes you to a destination you never thought you would be taken to that's what i believe is happening to my libras right now you're transcending on so many levels and you need to be patient because everything is going to come and you're going to wind up in that destiny that you're supposed to be in if you flow like that river. Okay? You guys, this is Jennifer Felix. I'm sending light and love. Light and love to my beautiful Libras. Flow like that river, my Libras. Flow like that river. Love and light.